Hello and welcome to CGF 2015. Can you please tell us in a few words what your initiative is within your organization field of work involved on where you are located? Good afternoon, I am Pascal representing Solutions, which is the short for Shelter Solutions. We, our work can be divided in three parts. The first part would be to provide shelters to typhoon victims, calamity victims. There's so many happening in the Philippines, uh, maybe with the climate change also, and therefore we feel it is a real necessity to provide shelters. So the second point is uh, using bamboo, a very sustainable material, and uh, we commit to replant three bamboo for each pole we use in our shelter fabrication. Uh, the third point is to better use this bamboo, to engineer it and to plant it in advance. We have seen the earthquake Jogjakarta in Indonesia in 2006. They built about 95,000 shelters out of bamboo. They exhausted the forest there because they were working on reacting to the catastrophe. Our aim is to prefabricate and prepare and really plant three bamboo for each bamboo we use. We want to make it sustainable. And engineered bamboo will open the door to new products able to be exported. I think that sums up the three points. Shelters, bamboo and engineered this bamboo. Okay. What message or needs do you wish to share at CGF 2015 on in general? The message is uh, clearly to promote prefabrication and not wait to react after calamities because it gets sustainable this way and uh, we want to be more known and hope to be able to supply a hundred shelter or more to show our efficiency and uh, we developed now this yurt type of shelter which are very easy to transport and deploy and uh, we think we found a great way to help victims of calamities. Okay. In what ways are your initiatives connected to the values of Oryu? We think that we do a lot of good and how are you is about connection for good so our initiative will empower remote farmers farming bamboo that is very rewarding one hectare requires little work and uh, gets good uh, income then we make good shelters that uh, dignify the users and gives them security safety much more than a tent for about the same cost and then we make good to the nature we reforest and uh, bamboo also absorbs lots of co2 it's a fantastic uh, natural mean to help uh, the victims and then we do good in engineering this bamboo where we will use it more efficiently and more standardized so the philippine government is looking to supply 35 percent of uh, government and school government school government school yeah that belongs to government to supply them with furniture made out of bamboo 35 percent is the goal but they have much difficulty to reach this because bamboo is only good if you treat it good at the start and you use it correctly and the bamboo is very bulky so if you engineer this bamboo like we do we believe we can uh, help lots of small vendors into this supplying cheap 
and very good furniture made of bamboo in the Philippines for a start. I think that sums it up. What inspires you, makes you dream and makes you act? So, climate change, the need of, of producing sustainable bamboo, a fantastic material. Bamboo has 1,001 uses and uh, it's growing so fast. So the dream is to make first a factory to get the ability to get this factory to prefabricate the shelters ahead of calamity and we would like to have also a kind of bamboo university where we teach more about nursery for bamboo farming and engineering this bamboo it's uh, and this can be very well associated this university learning about it and using it intensively by producing the so many shelters needed so this is the message we want to try to get through it's a kind of a moral duty in the philippines to have shelter prefabricated ready of calamities and we look to find the correct support to having a, the first order of a hundred shelters or so to show how efficient your design that we developed with only few slats can be. We need less than 30 bamboo to shelter safely a family of five. So that's a very efficient regarding resources. And uh, that's about it. Uh, solutions. We look for shelter solutions and engineered bamboo. Thank you to listen to that speech.